Hey guys, it's me, Saskin for 3 and I'm here for another comparing video. And this one, actually, I don't think anyone ever even requested this. <laughs> but I'm going to do it because I feel like it. Today we're going to be comparing the signature ocelot with the signature endangered clouded leopard. So, I wanted to do this because I still think the ocelot looks more like the cloud leopard than the snow leopard. And I don't know. I just I really want to point this out <laughs> and get my point across here, cause I am I'm that person that'll do this. Anywho, let's get on down to it. First things first. She has brown eyes, and Clara here also has brown eyes, but they're a lighter color, not really hazel, but a lighter lighter brown. And they both have a spotted pattern that goes on their face. It's a light spot that goes along the face all around, really. It has these streaks, same places that go down to their neck, you know. And uh, she has little spots for whiskers and a pink nose. Also, the top here is short furred. And she also has little spots for whiskers pink nose, little beige fur right there, and um, she has this light, light cream color that goes down to here, and it kind of switches to a more cream color, that's really just about a white, and this cream color that goes all the way down her belly, and she has the same cream color here, only with her chest, she gets a little black coloring for stripes that goes down, and this color goes all the way down to right there. She doesn't have any fuzz in her ears, while Clara here has the beige fuzz. And her back, the back of her ears are solid black, and has she has teddy bear ears while she has cat ears here. You can see it even has the whites in the back. Now to where the big differences come in, she has, of course, ocelot skin. It's just beige with black outlining and this caramel color from the spots. Well, she, it's kind of, it's um, dark brown, only like a half circle, three quarters of a circle with a, it's kind of a burnt brown, I guess you would say. And that's her main color. It goes all the way down to her tail. But um, she just has, it goes all the way down past her legs. Well, her tail is ringed almost. Uh, with her legs, she has spotted, short-haired legs, and she has just the regular fur on her back that goes all the way down to her paws, where she gets this light cream color at the bottom of her feet. And their W's are both on the same paw. In the front right, it's my right, their left. And they each have the same tish tag, as you can see. And yes, I'm going to be that person that shows the front and back of the tush tags because I can be that person even though no one really cares. I'm I'm going to do that because I want to. You have to show every part of the pet. You have to show every part of the pet. Yeah, the really the only difference I see is that this one's a bit darker shade of brown or beige, whatever you want to call it. So, and the ears. That's like the only differences I really see in these pets. But yeah, they might not be very similar, but I still think they're more similar than the snow leopard. So, anyways, um, can I recommend these pets? Yes, I can. If I had to pick, which one would I like better? I'd say the ocelot. I, I'm just a sucker for that, and plus, this, the cloud leopard's in this laying down position, which is cute and all, but I prefer webkins I can move around, and that is the ocelot right here. So, yeah, um, <laughs> I guess that's really all for this video. I mean, there's nothing else I can really say. So, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later! Later!